Deputy Prime Minister Christia Freeland put on a hard hat and toured the Mosaic Potash Mine near Kalanzi, getting a closer look at the product that is putting Saskatchewan on the map and getting to know the people working at the mine site, like Dustin Oros, who explains that potash is a key ingredient in fertilizer, this white stuff which helps feed the world. Potash is one of the key nutrients in, in crop production. It's, when you're buying fertilizer at the store, it's the K on the bag. Um, the stuff that we produce, uh, you'll see it as red, and it certainly helps uh, with crop nutrition. Saskatchewan produces about one-third of the world's potash, exporting to dozens of countries. Farmers around the world depend on our potash, on the potash you see right there. And that means that millions and millions of people depend on the work that is being done here right now to eat. And the industry has been growing too. This mine here was actually idle for years because of market conditions. But last summer, they started production up again, and there are no signs they will be slowing back down. Our forecast right now is we're just north of a million short tons. Uh, we're kind of stepping up our production and, and ramping up. The demand for Saskatchewan potash has steadily increased this year. The violent Russian invasion of Ukraine and the global sanctions that followed caused major disruptions in the supply chain. The work being done here is more important than ever. You are feeding the world and in doing that, the work you're doing here also is helping the very brave people of Ukraine by providing the world with an alternative to Russian and Belarusian exports. Saskatchewan has benefited from a surge in potash prices. It's one reason the province now expects to finish this fiscal year with a $1 billion budget surplus. Freeland says she sees huge economic opportunities for Saskatchewan as it brings more potash to the world. Kendall Latimer, CBC News, Kalanzi.